Facebook or by calling me at 208-9847. Tell me what you think. You understand when we say, when I look at you honestly, and I like you. You know, you're, you're a nice guy. I look at you, though, and I honestly say to you, I don't trust you. And I don't trust you because I don't know you. And I look at people who go for these seats, I don't trust them. And that's what everyone's feeling right now. Why in the world should we trust auctioneer Billy Long? Well, if you knew what I had to give up to do this, a lot of people say, well, you're going to get up there and you're going to sell out just like everybody else. You're going to go up there and grandize yourself. You're going to be making more money. Well, number one, that's way off. Number two, they have gamed the system. They don't want lifetime politicians up there. I wanted to do this in 96 when Roy did it, but my kids were too young. I wanted to do it in my head, but it's a practical matter. I could never do it. Kids were too young. I wasn't going to raise them in D.C. You have to sell your business. If you have a fiduciary business, you have to sell that. So I've got to walk away from a business I built up for 30 years. Who's going to buy it without me there? Answer, nobody. Whoever I sell it to has to take my name off of it. Now what's it worth? Absolutely nothing. I own a third interest in the largest real estate company in Springfield. I have to sell that. Do you want to buy a real estate company today? You know, they're not worth anything. And I have to give up my real estate broker's license. And then they hamstring you so any business person doesn't want to go serve.